Namaste. Today, in this video, we are going to discuss about problem solving and searching. Okay, so let us understand what is problem. Problem is defined as the relation between state space, initial state, goal state, and rules and action. Okay, four part. So I will repeat again: state space, initial state, goal state, and last one is rules and action okay so state space is the space of the state that can be occur during the solution of the problem okay and initial state is first state or starting state okay and goal state is the final state which we have to reach to solve the problem and rules and action are those rules which we use during the solution of the problem okay and searching is the process to search for the solution in the problem okay by using various type of searching strategies so problem solving is the process of generating solution from observed data which is characterized by a set of goals a set of object and set of operation okay now so how to solve the problem or problem formulation okay problem formulation when a problem arises then how do we solve it so first we have to define the problem so this is the first step okay define the problem precisely okay that means we have to know the input goal and initial state so these are the required for points for defining a problem precisely what are the inputs what goal we need and what is the initial state next is we have to analyze the problem we have to analyze the problem then we have to see the problem what the problem says and how can we obtain okay and next one is isolate and represent knowledge necessary okay to solve problem so after analyzing the problem we have to isolate and represent the knowledge necessary to solve the problem so what are the required knowledge to solve the problem we represent it the next one is choose best problem solving approach or method and apply it to particular problem okay so after representing the knowledge and we choose the best problem solving solving approach or technique and apply in the problem to get the solution okay so let us consider an example measuring problem okay and let us get 4 liter are to measure 4 liter by using 3 liter and 5 liter jar okay measuring problem we have to measure 4 liter by using 3 liter and 5 liter jar okay and we know that we have done in previous time or in past by using simple mathematics but how does we solve or how do we solve this problem in artificial intelligence by using 
problem solving technique okay and this solution is given in the video okay i have made the video to measure 4 liter from 3 liter and 5 liter jug artificial intelligence part 2 okay please view that okay we are moving to the next so now let us discuss about types of problem okay so first is single state problem for single state problem the environment is deterministic and accessible okay so environment is deterministic and accessible okay since it is deterministic and accessible the agent knows everything about the world and can calculate optimal action sequence to reach to the goal state okay since it is deterministic and accessible the agent knows everything about the world and can reach the goal by using optimal state or optimal cost for example playing chess when opponent moves a single state then we can count the number of state or we get number of state but for winning we move a single state yes that is single state problem next one is multi state multi state problem okay and for this environment is deterministic but it is inaccessible or not accessible okay since it is deterministic and inaccessible inaccessible in this problem as in does not know the exact state of the given environment so he or she or it has to assume while working towards the goal state okay it knows about the environment but does not know about state so example is working in dark room we know where the substance are there in the room but when it is dark then we know we don't know where to move the direction that is state so the agent does not know about the exact state so we have to assume is this way or that way yes when working in the dark room so this is it's called multi stage problem okay next one is contingency problem so for this environment it's non deterministic and inaccessible okay the environment is both non deterministic non deterministic and inaccessible inaccessible in contingency problem that means agent has to use sensor or sense during the execution and solution tree okay solution is in tree form and policy of on interleave to solve the execution that means when a new skater okay new skater is placed in the new arena then he or she does not know about the arena okay so that is called contingency problem and d okay last one is exploration problem and for this the environment is non deterministic okay non deterministic but accessible okay C yes yes i b l okay accessible in explorer session problem the agent has to discover 
and learn about the environment while taking the action. It is non-deterministic, so it does not know what environment is accessible. That means by viewing the environment or object of the environment, the agent has to learn and get knowledge. Okay, for this we can take as example as maze game. When we play maze game for the first time, we may lose the game, but we know the knowledge where to move in second game. Yes, that means the agent learns by viewing the environment since it is accessible. So explore the environment. Okay, these are the types of problem. Now let us move to the characteristics of source strategies. Okay. So while solving the problem, we use sort strategies. I have said earlier, yes. So what are the characteristics of sort strategies? Or it is also known as performance measure. Okay. For the sort strategies, a performance measure or performance measure parameter. Okay. So first parameter to measure the performance measure of source strategies this is completeness is the given source strategies or use source strategies complete or not that means does it always finds the solution if it is exists or not okay that is called completeness next one is time complexity Okay, total time accumulated or used by the searching process or searching strategies is known as time complexity. Same as space complexity. Okay, that means total space or memory used by the strategies, searching strategies while solving the problem. And last one is optimality okay optimality that means does it guarantees the optimal solution or not that means does it guarantees that least cost solution or not there may be number of solution but we need optimal solution that means least cost solution okay this is called optimality Okay, and in next video, we will be continuing this problem solving and sourcing. And in next video, we will be discussing about sourcing strategies. Okay, informed and uninformed sourced. Okay, thank you and bye bye.